Well, polling places open in 13 hours. Gun violence will be top of mind for Philadelphia voters as Pennsylvanians head to the polls for the primary election. Philadelphia Mayor Jim Kenney is making it clear that voter intimidation will not be tolerated. He announced the city's election task force is stepping up operations ahead of election day. Matt Petrillo is outside Philadelphia City Hall right now with the story. Matt. Yuki, the role of the task force is to investigate possible criminal activity related to the primary, and voters we spoke with are happy to know that steps are being taken to prevent any issues. The mayoral position in this city is really important. Tom Vernon of Center City is voting to see change in Philadelphia. I want to have the sensation that things are in hand. That, that People who are there are not only know what to do, but are competent to do it. He feels leaders are working hard to protect all votes. Under no circumstances will we tolerate interference or intimidation. Philadelphia Mayor Jim Kenney announcing the district attorney's election task force will be out Tuesday to investigate potential criminal activity at polling places. If you see or experience someone loitering in polling places or at drop boxes trying to hinder or delay the election process, Please report these incidents by calling the DA, the district attorney's office, election task force hotline. The number to the election task force hotline is 215-686-9641. The PPD is actually a member of the DA's election day task force, and our command staff will remain in direct communication with that task force tomorrow. The task force is an extension of the district attorney's office. We have a team of assistant district attorneys available to answer the phones, to hear about complaints. That are happening throughout the day, and then dispatch teams out onto the field to see what's happening. Voters say it allows them to have peace of mind when they cast their ballots. It's been a tough choice, and I have spent a lot of time thinking about it. And that's what so many voters have been telling us today. Now, the election task force hotline will remain open until election results are certified. Reporting live in Center City, I'm Matt Petrillo. Just back to you. All right, Matt, thank you for that.